now we're going to do a bit of feature comparison. Okay, so first navigation. Classic view, okay. We have seen the classic view here. So the home page is classic view. As you've seen before, I think we switched projects. Uh, this here is a suite date view. So as you see, you can like say this view is on suite dates mode and the record view is on legacy mode, classic view mode. Okay, that's basically that's it. So that's configurable through a config, uh, which is this one here, config services module, module route. Okay, and that takes us to our projects overview, the overview of our project structure. But on our on your root folder for Suite 8, you'll have the public folder. Within the public folder, you have legacy. And legacy is your Suite 7 with the extra changes I spoke about before. Okay, this is config, PHP, config override, everything is here. Okay, the only thing it doesn't have is the vendors folder. Uh, so th that's here. So if you want to do a customization on your on your custom module, or or if you, if you go through Studio, it will generate to publicly pub, public legacy modules and your module. Okay. If you want to to add like an extension to Vardes or Detail View Devs or whatever, you'll go to public legacy custom and the same structure as before. Everything still applies. And then there's a core folder which I won't be covering today and a config folder, okay? This config folder has many Symfony style configs using YAML. All of these you can extend on the extensions folder. We also won't be talking about that today. I'll just show you where things are. And then on a, another se session, I'll explain how to extend those on the extensions. But the, the file path will be very similar. The structure will be very similar. It's just it, once I give an example, you know how to do the others. Okay. So for now, I'm just going to explain what configurations are available, where they are, and what you can do with those. Okay. Services module, module routing. If you have, see this file here, module routing, which is a YAML file. It has false, true, blah, 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 and some have true. I mean, all the ones that have true, me, they mean that it's using suite mode, false means a classic view mode. Okay. So, and this is only for the three views that are implemented, which is lists, records, and create, but recreate will fall back on records. So it's the same. By changing some value to uh, false or to true, you're able to show that view in classic view mode. One thing to note is any change on suite side, you have to do a thing, which is to uh, clear the Symfony cache. Okay which you can do by like doing this, running this command. The other option, which I think you won't be doing that too much, it's just going here and deleting the contents of the cache folder and they will be regenerated. It's the same, okay? So any change, remember to do a cache clear. Otherwise it will keep uh, using cache. Unless you're on dev mode. Dev mode, it, it won't use cache, okay? And it will be a bit slower. So this is classic view.